what's up everybody in this video you're gonna be learning how your hormones are made and how you can optimize your hormones hey what's up everybody it's me Amir as you can see right here this is your hormone pathway now if we're gonna follow the pathway the first thing in order for you to have proper hormones is cholesterol from cholesterol, your body will convert the cholesterol into your master hormone called pregnenolone. Now, pregnenolone obviously likes to give birth. So through pregnenolone, you get your secondary master hormone called DHEA. Now, DHEA does not like to be alone. So DHEA likes to go, it likes to also have companions in its life. So from DHEA, it's gonna create estrone, so your estrogen families and it's gonna create testosterone for the man, so the testosterone family. This is a very basic diagram of your hormones. The reason I want to really focus on this today is the top, the pyramid, the word cholesterol. So right now, a lot of people are cholesterol phobic. They think cholesterol is bad. You hear about LDL, HDL, and all this arguments of camps of what's right, what's wrong. At the end of the day, what matters the most is healthy cholesterol, the actual size and particles of cholesterol that you have in your body to create your hormones. So the problem in right now is we're eating very trans fat, these processed foods, these industrial oil foods such as canola oil, soy oil, vegetable oil. All these are highly processed and they give your cholesterol a very bad shape. So instead of having, you should have really nice, maybe like fluffy, like marshmallow cholesterol that's really nice you guys end up having like this jagged, maybe like, you know, star-shaped cholesterol that causes problems and it can't properly be synthesized for your hormones. And that's why it's really, really crucial to have proper hormones in your body is eating healthy fatty foods. Yeah, I know I said it, fatty foods. Do not be afraid of fats. Through the history of the human evolution, we actually grew up eating fats. Our preferred fuel, that's right, our fuel in our body loves fats. So fats, I'm talking about, you know, coconut oils, saturated fats, monounsaturated fats, healthy grass-fed pasture meats, even getting fats from avocados and getting fats, like I said before, if you want coconut husk, all this is beneficial for creating healthy, fluffy cholesterol that you need to create your hormones. I really guys, hope you enjoyed this video. You wanna stay tuned for next week's videos because I'm gonna really explaining about how stress can actually come here and rob your hormones away from you. You know what to do. You gotta to subscribe to my channel, you gotta leave some comments, and remember, you gotta catch me next week.